Hey, 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 guys, this is Hawkeye, and I am back with another episode of Fishing North Atlantic. And we are here at Dennis Point. We have just offloaded a whole bunch of fish, managed to pull in oh, a little bit over $100,000. We're at $304,000. We bought a, a few upgrades here and there, gassed up. I think we're going to go ahead and rig this up for net fishing. Once we're done with that, I think we will probably go for lobster fishing. But uh, we've already got all these bought. It's just a matter of switching over. And hopefully we'll be able to go through the tutorial so you can see how each of these are done. Now this episode is going to be net fishing. And I'm saving the best for last, and that's the lobster fishing. I'm going to go ahead and equip the net fishing since, yep, it will start up the tutorial, which is great. Any active mission will be canceled. We don't have to worry about that. Let me go ahead and say yes. Now, it says right off the bat we need to buy nets. So it needs you have to go to the fish market and buy three nets. And they need to be 75 meter. I guess they just want us to get started on it. So I'm going to buy one, two, and three. There are three different sizes of net, fishing nets. Since nets don't need to be baited, you can reuse the net over and over again so long as you don't damage the net too much. So we've got three. Now it says exit the port by clicking the return button in the bottom right corner of, or pressing escape. Okay. Alright, we're going to go ahead and head out of town. Now I'm not really sure what we need to do from this point. So let's hit escape. Let's drive away from the docking area, so that's pretty straightforward. I do need to put my crew to rest, because they are and have been doing all the gutting. I had them do some, some of the fishing, but Okay, you can open, open the map to see your marked area and follow the marker on top of your screen in third-person mode. Okay. I'm going too fast again. I'm kind of a lead foot when it comes to the, <laughs> to the boats. Well, let's take a look at the map here. Let me see where our marker is. All right, it's not too far out here. And if we do a little skipping around, we can get there a little easier. I'm going to go to the Woods Harbor Lighthouse. And then from there... We can kind of finagle our way around here. Sometimes when we're doing this too, you can discover new areas, which is extremely useful. All right, let's zoom out a little bit. Now we're going to go over to here, get as close to we as we can. Now, let's see how close. Oh gosh, I hate doing this at night. So, I think what we might do is we might go ahead and dock here in forward time a little bit here. Let me change the first person. And go over here and we'll forward time to morning. It's just going to be a little bit easier to see what we're do be able to see what we're doing. Let's make it 7 a.m. Okay, it's still a little dark. Maybe it's the time of year. Let's Skip one hour. There we go. That's better. All right, now we'll go to third person. We'll pull into this little area. Yeah, I'm sure you guys are wondering why I'm not doing Fishing Planet right now. I am doing Fishing Planet. It's just that I am not anywhere close to getting all those banded Heracuz. So I couldn't do another episode and 
I just did one of the Fisherman Fishing Planet. So I've already got that recorded. And I'll put it out after this this first episode here. Looks like we have fish and everything swimming around out there. We're going to slow this down a little bit. I see all kinds. It's too bad we weren't... Okay, now that you've reached the mark area, it's time to set your first net. Okay. Alright, go to first person. Go to the work deck. Pick up a net bucket, alright? This time I have to do everything... the hard way, I guess. Grab it. Set the neck bucket by the net setter. Where is that? See, when we were doing the other thing was back here, but that's not where that is. Is this it? I guess that's it. No? Oh. C, J, set net. Well, maybe this is it, guys. Okay, pair. Oh, okay. And it says... To successfully set the net, keep the marker in the center. By steering your boat accordingly, the net will do damage if you fail. to get up here because I'm not exactly doing a drive in here oh now that you set your first net you need to wait a minimum of four hours before you can pick up for purpose of this tutorial the game will now be skipped for 20 hours 20 hours is the optimum time for a net should stay in the area you can see this by looking at the outline color of the boy in the map the best time to pick up the line is the, for the best yield is when the outline is blue Okay, okay, there we go. Now you need to haul the net. In order to haul the net, you need to position the boat such that both of the boys are starboard, the right side of the boat, both boys, okay? And at least one of the boys within a few meters of the net hauler. A semicircular region will be highlighted green when one of the boys is positioned close enough to the net hauler. An arrow will point to the other boy and will also be highlighted green once this boy is starboard. Okay. Alright, clear as mud, guys. <laughs> uh, so, I need to come over here. So, there need to be two of us. I don't know. We'll see, I guess. thing I don't like is it is night and rainy. I don't even know oh, it's behind us. So we need to turn around. Basically, I gotta make a complete circle, more or less, get myself pointed in the right direction. semicircular thing but apparently I have to get 
either the first one or the second one, or I don't even know. Heck. Maybe I have to get the second one. I don't, I'm not sure. It's on the right side. It's not doing anything. Ah, so I need, need another person to help me haul the net so could have told me that back up again because you know it could have been a little more clear <sighs> this is not easy to do Hauling a net, you need to press the left mouse button when the indicator is within the red area to collect the fish from the net. Failing to hit within the red area will damage your net, but you will still get the fish. If a net gets too damaged, you will need to repair it before you can use it again. Okay, I'm not sure what the heck... I missed. Okay, I'm... Gosh, that doesn't give me much time to react. Good. Okay, I suck at this. Perfect. First one. Perfect. Okay, I've got the hang of it. Oh, that was... We're getting a lot of fish here. Thirteen thousand pounds. Holy crap, that's definitely the money maker there, guys. Ooh boy. Thirteen thousand pounds of fish. Okay, now it wants me to move to the gutting table to interact with it, but how in the world am I gonna do that? We have a machine gutting gutting table. Maybe I have to have somebody else on there. Let's see here. Let's put Sadie at the machine gut. Let's put her back to resting for the moment. sure what I'm supposed to do. I don't have any... There's no gutting tape. 
not sure what's going on here, guys. I can't seem to make anything work. <laughs> Maybe I was supposed to have your good old fashioned gunny tape. I can't seem to interact with this at all. So, I think what we'll do is we'll go ahead and set another net or two. Because we've got two of them. So we prepare it. Okay, so I gotta get to the wheel to steer the boat. It looks pretty good. And we, we set another one. I don't know how far away we have to be from the other one to get it to go. Let's go ahead and do this. I'm going to go ahead and put one of the ladies on it. I guess Sadie is now they're pretty much rested. So put her there. Let her continue to rest. Actually, maybe she could do some repairs to the nets. That won't hurt anything. Once she gets there, we can just set it and I can just guide the boat better anyway. That's what the crew's for. And I'm the pilot. Okay, it looks like it's setting pretty easy, but then the seas are not too bad. Maybe she can set another net here. We have three, and we already pulled one. Still too close. There we go. I wish you could see the net coming out, because that's probably pretty cool to watch. Alright, we've got all of our nets set. I'm going to go ahead and put her over here to see machine gutting we got to get that finished I'm gonna take the boat around get to the beginning of the line all right the fastest way to do that would be just to do this Let's get this, like, right there so we can pull up to it. All right, and then we'll go back in. While they're doing some gutting, I'm going to go ahead and go to first person here. 
don't know why I can't interact with this gutting table. Well, they're just standing there, so apparently it's all... They're all gutted, or something. Well, they're fast. I'll let them rest. Well, I don't know how to do that part of the tutorial, unfortunately, but we're going to go ahead and get some more fish and try to make this trip worth our while. I'm going to take a look at the map here. We've got the first one. It's only been there an hour and 20 minutes. So, we need to advance time about, about 18 hours, maybe 19. 19 be pushing it, but we'll we'll try it. 19 hours. And it's light, which is great. That way we'll be able to see what our do we're doing. Alright. I'm gonna go ahead and put them situate the crew members. I'm going to put her, Sadie, at net hauling with me. I'll let Pearl rest. Sadie's a little bit better at all this stuff than Pearl is. And I want to be 100% certain that we make the most out of this. Even if I miss, I'm still better than the two of them are. It seems like they usually just get okays when it comes to fishing on their own without me. That will change over time. Pretty soon they'll have a down pat as they build their skills. I don't know if I have to Speed way down, way down, way down. No fish were caught. Wait a minute, wait a minute, what the hell? It didn't advance time. It didn't advance time enough. Shoot. Well, it says 13 hours, 15 minutes. Not sure how that went wrong. It's not the first time that's happened. Now the clocks are kind of weird. All right, let's go ahead and put her to rest. This time is kind of weird. I don't want to skip 24 hour, hours. But if it's 13 hours, I only need 6 more hours. No more. And it's going to be night, of course. Let's check the map. Well, it's ideal. So maybe we'll make up for what we screwed up on that one. Alright, let's go ahead set our crew out again. Let's try to do this again. So apparently you have to pass the first one then get to the second one to get it to work. Okay, we're going to get this speed down. Our 
supposed to be arrows to tell me something, but it really does. I don't see any arrows. Alright, let's get on this one. Like Sadie's doing her business. There we go. Good. So far, just good. <laughs> yeah, this is harder than the others. Oh, that one got perfect. Six thousand pounds of fish, not too bad. Not as good as the last time, but still not too bad. Get to the next one, and that should be the one we need. Going too fast. Gotta slow her down considerably. Alright, let's get this fish. Ugh, that was sucked. Perfect. Damn it. Dog distracted me. Okay, I have no excuse that time. <laughs> 8,000 pounds. Alright, not bad, guys. Not bad at all. I think what we'll do is we'll go ahead and put these guys to. We're gonna go ahead and put these guys to work on the gutting. If there was a way for me to do it, I'd help them. Uh, I don't know how to to make that work. Well, all we can do is head on back home. Let's see, we already went there. Let's go here and see what we do at Yarmouth. By that time, the fish will have been gutted. All right.
right. So we're docking at Yarmouth. We have fish on board. Ooh, considerably more. Net income is 92000 and that's after paying their salary, so that wasn't too bad. We'll sell our catch. That takes us almost to $400,000. So that was net fishing for the first time. It is morning again, guys. I thought I'd come on in and get things fixed up before we sign off for good. Let's go ahead and get our maintenance done. Got to do a little bit of repair, get a little bit of fuel. I don't know what's wrong with my puppy tonight, but he is demanding attention. Need to see if the fishing gear needs any repair. A little bit there. And that was it. Not too bad. You do make a lot more money a lot quicker this way. I will, I, you know, definitely will say that. A lot better than long line fishing. But I think next time we're going to go out and do some lobster fishing, guys. That's the stuff I really want to do. Lobster fishing. Well, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Please be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe. And as I always say, guys, aim straight, cast far, and have fun. And I will see you later. Bye-bye.